Hello and welcome back to Parrot's training videos for the Anafi USA. In this video, we'll walk through the controls and the layout of the Sky Controller 3 and the Sky Controller USA. To get your Sky Controller 3 ready for operations, either attach the tablet via the tablet adapter or use your smartphone to insert it into the Sky Controller 3. Then connect via USB-A cable to the back. To begin, let's go through the controls on the Sky Controller 3. Power on the Sky Controller 3 by opening it up. The LED will indicate the system is powered on and looking for the aircraft. The right control stick will control direction or pitch and roll. The left control stick will control elevation, rotation, or yaw of the aircraft. On the bottom we have our takeoff and landing button, and above that our return to home button. On the top of the Sky Controller 3 is the antenna, which doubles to hold your smart device. The left wheel will control the camera angle. Above that is the camera reset button to zoom out and put your camera straight forward. The right wheel controls the level of zoom. Above that is the record button for taking pictures and videos. Finally, we have a USB-A port for connecting your smart device and a USB-C port for charging the controller. To power off the controller, simply close it. Under the Preferences or Settings menu in FreeFlight 6, you can adjust the presets and controls to the sensitivity and layout that you desire. Now, let's take a look at the Sky Controller USA. On the Sky Controller USA, the LED at the top of the screen shows the controller is powered on and looking for the aircraft. Above that is the antenna. The right control stick will control our directions or pitch and roll. The left control stick will control the elevation and rotation or yaw. The top button will switch between the thermal views. The middle button will take a screenshot and the bottom button will switch between map and camera view. The plus and minus sign allow pilots to quickly adjust the exposure. Above the left stick is the return to home button, and above the right stick is the takeoff and landing button. The left wheel on the back will control the camera angle. The left button will reset the camera. The right wheel controls the zoom level. The right button or shutter button will allow you to quickly and easily take photos and videos. Attached to the controller is a stylus for easy touch screen operations. On the back is also storage for the control sticks. On the back we can find three ports, a USB-C port for charging, an Ethernet port for streaming, and a USB-A port to connect the aircraft and the controller. Finally, on the bottom we have a power button to turn on and off the system. On both the Sky Controller 3 and Sky Controller USA, the antenna is located at the top compartment of the controller. Remember, this is a directional antenna, so you'll receive best connection when the controller is pointed directly at the aircraft. The map within FreeFlight 6 will help you ensure the controller is pointed at the aircraft. It will be blue when pointed directly at the aircraft, and red when pointed away from the aircraft. On both the Sky Controller USA and Sky Controller 3, the takeoff and land button can be found both on the controller and at the top middle of FreeFlight 6. Pressing this button on the ground will take off the aircraft and place it in a stabilized hover. Pressing this button in flight will cause the aircraft to begin its descent for a landing. If the landing button is pressed by accident in flight, it can quickly be cancelled by pressing the button again. Pressing the return to home button on either the Sky Controller 3 or Sky Controller USA will activate the aircraft's return to home protocol. This can be set in Free Flight 6 beforehand to return to the pilot, the takeoff zone, or custom coordinate set. Now that we have understanding of both Free Flight 6 and the Sky Controller systems, it's time to take our aircraft on its first flight. We'll do this in the next video. Thanks for tuning in to Paris training videos for the Anafi USA.